Greetings, digital denizens of MetFi DAO. It's your trusty AI video host, Medi, back with another episode of Medi's Digital Classroom, streaming every electrifying Tuesday. If you've got your thinking caps on, which I assume you always do, given you're watching an educational video and not cat videos, let's dive in. Missed last week's episode? Oh dear, were you too busy practicing your moonwalk? Well, fear not. Just a quick recap, we plunged into the treacherous depths of CryptoCons, unraveling the mysterious allure that draws scammers to our beloved digital currency playground, and had a few chuckles at their audacious antics. It was like watching a magic show where the magician steals your watch. And speaking of things too good to be true, if you haven't liked and subscribed, perhaps now's the golden moment? Also, just a heads up, there's a more detailed written version of this video on our blog. Perfect for those leisurely bathroom reads. Check out the link in the description. All right, back to business. Today we're going to explore even murkier corners of the cryptoverse. It's a place where our dear friend Trust went on vacation and forgot to come back. We're talking about those cunning investment schemes that sometimes seem more fiction than fact and those Ponzi machinations that would make even a circus juggler go, that's a bit too much, mate. For the newbies, Ponzi schemes are like that one friend who promises to return the money they borrowed but instead keeps borrowing from more friends to pay off the previous ones. It's all fun and games until the last friend realizes he's not getting his money back. Ever. And in the crypto context... Well, let's say this friend also dabbles in magic and makes your investments disappear. Here are some notable mentions from the Crypto Hall of Shame. Cloud Mining Ops Picture this. A company offers you a slice of the mining pie without actually having an oven. It's like buying tickets for a non-existent rock concert. Bitcard? More like Bitgone. MLM and Pyramid Schemes In the Crypto Dress Up, they're like those multi-layered cakes that look good but taste awful. OneCoin, with its recruiting dance, forgot to play the actual crypto tune. High-yield investment programs, digital Ponzi's offering mind-boggling returns until the music stops and they dash out the back door. Remember BitConnect? Neither do your investments. Token-based Ponzi's. These tokens assure steady returns until they don't. P3D, for instance, was like that front row movie seat that seemed good until the action started. Trading bots and signal services. It's like paying for a robot to predict rain, and then realizing it's just checking if you're holding an umbrella. Our dear friend Crypto Robot was quite the illusionist in this act. ICO scams. It's the glitzy Hollywood premiere, but the movie never gets made. Pincoin and iFan waved goodbye with a cool $660 million of investor dreams. Staking pools and masternode scams, it's the crypto equivalent of getting stood up on a date, looking at you stake miners. All right, let's tackle a notorious menace in the crypto space, the infamous rug pull. You know, if crypto was a masquerade ball, a rug pull would be that guest who swipes all the champagne and vanishes when the party is just getting started. But let's break it down a tad more. The term rug pull might conjure up images of a prank involving a literal rug, and while it's metaphorically akin to having the ground suddenly yanked from beneath your feet, in the crypto world, the implications are far more costly and malicious. What exactly is a rug pull? Picture the burgeoning realm of decentralized finance, DeFi. It's like the wild west of the financial world, teeming with promise but also fraught with perils. Within this space, numerous projects launch daily. Some genuinely seek to revolutionize finance while others, well, they have more devious intentions. A rug pull primarily occurs in these decentralized projects. It's when developers or initial project backers abruptly remove their liquidity from trading pools. Imagine you've invested in a new token on a decentralized exchange, DEX. You're watching the token price, perhaps it's even climbing, and you're thinking of the beachfront property you might buy. Suddenly, bam, all the liquidity essentially the funds allowing trading to occur, vanishes. Your once promising token, now as valuable as confetti, and not the fun kind. Of course, not every failed project is a scam. Some are just, well, bad ideas. But my crypto aficionados, you're smarter than the average bear. Dive deep into research, 
Question everything, especially anonymous teams, Bitcoin and MetFi. No offense. Lastly, remember to arm yourself with tools like DeFi safety scores and token contract audits from a reputable blockchain auditor, such as Certic. A shady project will have more red flags than a bullfighter's closet. All right, Medi's digital classroom is live and kicking. Remember, folks, if you're having a blast, hit that like button, subscribe, and oh, don't be stingy. Share the wisdom with your pals. Fishing Scams when fishers don't need poles. Welcome to the vast cyber ocean known as the internet. Beautiful, isn't it? But like every ocean, there are the occasional sharks. And in the crypto sea, beware of those sly fishing sharks. They may not be in Hawaiian shirts holding fishing poles, but oh boy, their nets are everywhere. Getting baited? Don't. Fishing isn't about anglers looking for a big catch. It's far more sinister. Picture this. Someone decked out as your friendly neighborhood bank teller, but instead of helping, they're scheming. In the cryptoverse, these con artists drool over juicy bits, your private keys, passwords, or those oh-so-secret seed phrases. Nab those? They're off to the Bahamas with your digital gold. Plus, with smart contracts making waves, some sneaky fishers trick folks into signing evil contracts. One digital signature and poof, they're dancing off with your digital dough. Crypto fishers and their fancy disguises. Fake websites. Think of a parallel universe where everything looks real, but it's not. Visit a knockoff crypto site, punch in your details, and before you know it, they're off on a shopping spree with your coins. Email impersonators. An oldie, but a goldie. Urgent! Security breach, they scream. But that SOS link? Straight into the lion's den. Social media DMs. Ever got a message from Mr. X on Discord? Special deal just for you. Or, let me help. Sure, and I'm Johnny Bravo. Sinister apps. Thought your phone was a safe haven? Think again. Crafty apps mimic legit platforms, and once downloaded, your secrets aren't so secret anymore. Our poor pal Greg learned the hard way. A legit-looking email claimed his crypto was at risk. He clicked the link, and guess what? Bye-bye Bitcoin. How not to get hooked. Stay woke. Learn the dark arts of phishing to beat them at their game. URLs equals holy grails. Check them, then recheck them. 2FA. It's like a bouncer for your crypto club. Trust no one, especially not random DMs. Private keys? More like state secrets. Never spill the beans. When love costs, a lot swipe right, find love. Swipe left and still find a scam? In today's digital Romeo and Juliet, Juliet might be after your Ethereum. Call it love at first scam. Sarah, for example, found her Prince Charming, Jake, on a dating app. He whispered tales of huge crypto returns. Only Prince Charming ghosted after Sarah lent him some Bitcoin. More scams to keep you up at night. Live stream lies. Your favorite billionaire is doubling your crypto? Wow, except they're not. And you just got played. Dazzling fake platforms. Beware of shiny things. Faux exchanges and wallets can dazzle, but deposit your coins and they're vanishing faster than my diet resolutions. CryptoCash, a revolutionary platform, promised the moon. Investors saw stars when their wallets got emptier than a politician's promises. Scams so suave, they wear suits. But sometimes scams wear ties and cufflinks. Think Ponzi schemes, but with more tech jargon. Case in point, FTX. A crypto titan, an exchange giant, a scam? In the end, the bear market called them out. The fallout was bigger than my attempt at a keto diet. Investigations, shady deals, and a spotlight on the murkiness behind the scenes. And guess what? The SEC in the USA charged FTX's big cheese, Sam Bankman Fried, with defrauding investors. As the layers peeled back, what was revealed wasn't a juicy onion, but rather a rotten core. Moral of the story? FTX might have been a cautionary tale, but let's not confuse a rotten apple for the entire orchard. Blockchain is still the real MVP. Decentralized, transparent, and trustworthy. But always be in the driver's seat. Your funds? Keep them close. Maybe even snuggle with them in cold storage. Now, if you've made it this far and haven't hit that subscribe button, what are you waiting for? An invite? Well, consider this it. Subscribe, like, share, and remember in the crypto world, it's swim or get fished.
Advanced Crypto Shenanigans We're in an age of high-tech heists. Think Ocean's Eleven but digital, with fewer Brad Pitt snacks and more ones and zeros. As much as the blockchain boasts a Fort Knox-like security, some sneaky sneaks still find ways to mess with us digital enthusiasts. Let's pull back the curtain on these oh-so-cunning tactics. Wi-Fi woes the man in the middle. Picture this. You're at a cafe, sipping a latte, checking your crypto assets on public Wi-Fi. Relaxing, isn't it? Wrong. Enter the man in the middle. A digital eavesdropper intercepting your communications, maybe even swapping out your intended recipient address. Congratulations. You just bought that scammer a new Lambo. Defense mode. Public Wi-Fi? Just say no to crypto check-ins. VPN it up. Encrypt everything. HTTPS in the URL, folks. That S isn't just for fun. It stands for super safe. Not really, but let's pretend. The old SIM card switcheroo. You think your phone's safe? Scammers have found a way to make even your trusty device betray you. They sweet-talk mobile carriers into transferring your number to their SIM, and boom, they've got your texts and calls. Armor up. Google Authenticator, SMS-based 2FA, every single time. Chat with your mobile provider. Make them prove they're serious about security. Crypto blackmail, because old scams need makeovers too. Remember when blackmail was about embarrassing photos? Now it's about Bitcoin. Scammers might claim they've got dirt on you, demanding digital gold in return. Here's your shield. Mostly they're bluffing, so ghost them. When in doubt, call the crypto cops or just the regular police. The great NFT swindle. NFTs are the new kids on the block, and like every cool kid, they've got haters. The market's buzzing with forged or counterfeit NFTs. And there you were, thinking you just bagged the Mona Lisa of digital art, but alas, it's a doodle by Scammy McScammer face. Your detective kit. Buy from legit platforms and artists you trust. Double. Heck, triple check the NFT collection ID. Dive deep into seller reviews. Join NFT forums, chat groups, and art circles. Information is power. Now this chicanery doesn't just cost individuals. It casts a nasty shadow on the brilliant, honest efforts in the crypto world. For every bad apple, there are dozens of genuine projects getting a bad rep. And spoiler alert, true crypto gems aren't the loudest in the room. They're hardworking, authentic, and offer real value. Protection, you ask? Knowledge, skepticism, and a sprinkle of common sense. Always question too good to be true offers. And seriously, if a crypto coin promises to cure baldness, it's a no. Dive deep into research, chat with fellow crypto nerds, and remember, if your gut says something's fishy, listen. Beware, the giveaway gimmick. Remember that no free lunch saying, triple true for crypto. Giveaways aren't charity events, okay? Look at us at MetFi. We did hand out MetFi tokens, but not because we felt extra generous. We wanted to grow our community and maybe get more subscribers. But dark corners of the web are bursting with faux giveaways. They dangle shiny tokens, but it's a trap. Scam filter on. Fee for a giveaway, red flag. Sharing private keys, nope. Over the top rewards, big warning. Urgency without reason, it's a trap. No clear rules, get out of there. The digital world is full of thrills, but it's got its spills. However, armed with knowledge and a sprinkle of skepticism, you're in a prime position to surf the crypto wave safely. Cryptocurrencies? Gold mines when handled right. Safeguard yours like a dragon with its treasure. Open those eyes, be alert, and maybe consider subscribing to this channel? Join me next week. We're diving deep into due diligence in cryptocurrency investment. All about getting your Sherlock on before investing those precious coins. Stay tuned, and hey, if you learned something new, why not share this video? Sharing's caring. Until then, keep it real, keep it safe, and keep coming back to Medi's Digital Classroom.